What the hell is this shit? Let me out, goddammit! I'll kill that crazy bitch! Blah, blah, blah. Insects. Insects. As in you have an insect problem, or chicken crickets are keeping you up, or you have nightmares about them. Help me out here. No, no, no. Don't you know? When you fall asleep, they can crawl into your mouth through your ears. What the hell is this shit? Let me out, goddammit! I'll kill that crazy bitch! Are there any signs of this been misunderstanding. Uh, misunderstanding? As soon as I get out of here, I'm calling the goddamn cops. Let's see what they think of this, huh? I'll have them lock up both your asses. Maybe, you know. Yes. Whatever. I'll try to drain you up even know what year it is. What the hell does that mean? Wait, why are you looking at me like that? Hey! Come here. I've got a secret to tell you. So, you never sleep at night. I assume you do sleep, right? Uh, I sleep at work. And what exactly do you do? I'm a middle school teacher. That would explain why my nephew invested that 20 I sent him for his birthday on <laughs> It's always good to know that the future of our country is in good hands, isn't it? Oh boy. Let's see who else we got. <sighs> so I got Caller, trapped into that. What do you do for a living? I'm Roger. Okay, and what do you do, Roger? So, have you written any uh, movies I might have seen? Well, I actually haven't finished any it's a damn thing I, I did about five minutes ago. You stupid idiot. You fancy trapped me into that situation. So great. So. I've lost two points of humanity now. If I let him go, there'd have be, been masquerade violation though. Oi, woman. It's you. Earlier tonight, you weren't following me, were you? I had this feeling like I was being watched. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm still a little shook up. Somebody you don't know approaches you, shoot them in the head. If they're after you, yes, I'll do it. I just need to learn how to use a gun first. Okay, do that. I will. So, about your payments, uh, change it. Okay. Okay, so they have by the time I'll get back. Right, so I've got twenty-two dollars. Got a bit of other stuff to do. Let's go back to Hollywood and set this gargoyle out, whatever the heck it is. You know what? I'm gonna take a look at this shit. This abandoned, yeah, yeah, there, Lucky Star Motel. Urban. Yes, yeah, so I got. Yes, yeah, so I head back to Hollywood. And then just go and take a look at the room, the Lucky Star Motel. Then we'll look at this as well. It's Cafe Cavaletti. That's the place next to. Well, next to. Uh, the photo print place, whatever it's called.
going somewhere? Uh, yeah, away from here. Uh, Hollywood. to be a bit, uh, a bit useful. I'm just nipping there, but I've got 40, what, how many rounds have I got? 47 rounds altogether. It's not, I'm not out of ammunition any time soon. Do this cafe thing first. Oh. Mm. More flatbread and olive oil. And take back the Chardonnay and open up a Chianti. Let it breathe for 20 minutes and then bring it out with a ziti. Okay? I just wanted to, uh, to... Wanted to know what? Interrupt me while I'm working? Do you understand that this is an important opening, and I, emphasize I, am going to make or possibly break this restaurant? Uh, just exactly who you are, who are you to uh, feel you have so much power? Me, Tommy Flayton, the food authority of Los Angeles, food critic for the biggest paper on the West Coast, Radio personality for the KTLK? Chower hour? Maybe if I reviewed more pancake huts, you'd know me. Just a man I wanted to talk to. I'm not sure exactly what you mean. Is it in your best interest to pan this place? You've got a reputation to keep. How so? You're becoming the jerk of the film world. You give any anything a good review. You know, now that you mention it, the gnocchi was a bit cold, and the ravioli might have been store-bought. Also, the decorum's a bit lacking, isn't it? This place is just an overpriced cafeteria. No stars. Yes. I'm going to write a review that will destroy this restaurant. Good, good. I'll believe it now that my work is done. Good night. gonna pay me for this and I mean about a grand right, so there's the Asian Asian theatre I'm going to know you okay star motel Don't tell me actually which room though I did find a key to Lucky Star Motel though, so whichever the, uh, yeah. Whichever one that, whichever to lock the key fits, I suppose. Oh, hello. Sorry, no vacancies. I'm just taking a look around. Feel free, man. This is a treasure trove of human banality. Working here, you meet lots of types, man. You, you get stories, you get characters, you get like, you know, this is the kind of place where writers go to study human behavior, man. It's invaluable. So you're a writer? Writer's such a tarnished term, you know what I mean? It's like, like every other guy says he's a writer, right? Like, you write a letter, you're a writer, you know? It's like, what I do, that's like, that's screenwriting. Like, I encapsulate the essence of excellent film in my scripts, all right? Like, I'm, a, I'm like a blacksmith with pens, all right? I'm a welder of montage. So, what do you write? Does a writer write, or does he just, like, ink the flotsam and jetsam floating in his subconscious into a 120-page piece of film genius? But, you, you know, most of my subconscious is filled with old horror films, so that, that's what I write mostly, I guess. So... Horror films? What kind of horror film are you working on? 
Me? I'm like looking to redefine the vampire movie, okay? Like tons of people make vampire flicks, okay, popular characters, but me, I'm going to be doing the real deal. Like not only is it going to be scary, but it's going to be like it's going to be believable. Vampires. What do you know about vampires? Well, in my story, it's not like about garlic and bats, okay? It's about vampire societies and stuff. You know, like what would vampires be really all about? I mean, how do they blend into society without being discovered? Mm, I see. Well, I must be going now. See, I'm about these um... night eating you. By the way around. It's the key, that's the one we're going in. And that's a key card lock. So that. And that's a key card lock as well. Ah! Oh my god! My work is done. Right, where'd the body go? The salvage. Can he fit it through there? Do they? Does he fit it straight through that window? Hmm. I don't think so. Brother's Salvage. The carrier's Brother's Salvage Santa Monica. Yeah, I know where that is. Breaking in the towel. Oh, well, two hundred dollars nine to have that. Taking care of human beings, or don't get sort of eaten and what have you. It costs a lot of money. Devil. 
Backwards distribution since 1998. East makes printer. Lichens. Wells. Or is it? Open doors here often to the wealth in the sky. In the end, the ending, you'll manage to pass by. Open doors here often to the wealth in the sky. In the, e in the end, the ending, you'll manage to pass by. So let's get through a door. Open door here is off. Open doors here often. To the whale from the sky. No idea. Printer. Sending invoice list to printer. Please wait. What printer? Printer, there's no printer here. No printer in the show, is there? No, no printer there. Into any other parts of the year. The only thing is all key pass, key passwords, not keywords, key codes. Nothing here. Night eating you? Yeah, did you know there's a dead body in one of your rooms? Already? Man, that's early for tonight. What? Oh well, I'll, I'll, I'll call the cops, but who knows when they'll show up. To protect and serve, right? <laughs> mm, I guess I'm uh, out of here then. He seems too concerned, isn't he? The salvage in Santa Monica latest murder scene. Some call calls on one of the payphones down the street. But I can't actually. near the red spot.
Nice to meet us. Hello? The moon is a mysterious mistress. Who walks the night with demons of dread? The Lucky Star Motel. Room 2. Don't be long. Goodbye. Room 2. Internet cafe key. Why does it keep me sitting my gun? Shouldn't keep doing that. Someone's there. Uh... Yeah. That's what it means to get in here. Walk through the open door, through an open door. Which actually was closed. What the? What the hell's that? Open doors. And a werewolf in the sky. What is that supposed to be? That's some sort of hallucination. Was it projection? Well, it's a dancing werewolf. A dancing werewolf. Oh, God. Must be a projection of some kind. Night eating you? Other way around. Internet cafe key. to uh, get tooled up again. There's no waiting for you at the Hollywood Lucky Star Motel, but you did find a key to the internet cafe. <laughs> yeah, it's going to buy some more rounds from... Fair bit of money again. And, and you've tuned into the dev of night. Nobody to fall asleep next to? Go ahead and pull the Hola. radio into bed. That's what I'm here no, for. No, I don't like the special. And hey, why don't you call me sometime? Area code 323-KL5-KTRK. Looks like somebody's been waiting in the queue quite a while to speak to yours truly. So, caller, why aren't you? Where did I park my uh, car again? Uh, oh, wait, insects. I don't even have a As car, dude. you have an insect problem, dude, or tripping cow. crickets are keeping you <laughs> up, or you have nightmares Thank about you. them. Help me out here. Oh, no, no, no. Don't you know? When you fall asleep, they can crawl into your mouth or your ears or, or your nose. You, you can't prevent it if you're asleep. 
I mean, you, well, what can you do? Are there any scientists out there listening to this? Um, I, I read something. I, I don't know where. But do you know the average person eats several pounds really, of insects a year? I parked my car again. Oh, way. wait, I don't even have a car, dude. Just knowing that as soon as you close your eyes, a big fat centipede is going to drop into your mouth and crawl down your throat. <laughs> I can't do it. I never sleep at night. You know, they voluntarily... Shame I can't eat any more. Yeah, well, those countries probably need Jesus. Ooh. So Delicious. Never sleep at night. I assume Gloop. you do sleep, right? Uh, I sleep at work. And what exactly do you do? I'm a middle school teacher. That. Oh, he's gonna kick some ass. Computer. Enough, didn't I? Come get some. Corn studio, is it? Pizza, nice. Right, get you back to the wall. Personation for ventriloquist dummy without someone to stand up. I knew it now. Anything anywhere? Oh no no no! I 
，就这样说吧。Please keep, please keep slop tank clean at all times. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ew, grief. Show the people. Grab that and smash it on the head. Mm, done anything with that, but obviously you can't because you can't interact with stuff like that. I need to be able to throw stuff. Right, anyway. Can't get any information on these machines. Where the heck did I just shoot off to? Oh, there was a vent there on the floor. Vent cover, but I can't see a vent. Can't see a vent anywhere. Still there. Oh, come on. You can get through there. I'm not picking a six, seven, eight. I need f four more. I'm like absolutely certain I can't get through there, isn't it?
I can't get in there. So I'm thumping mode. Man, what the what the fuck is going on up there? Dead everyone slaughtered off. Oh god. Shh, shh, shh. Don't, don't make any noise. They'll, they'll hear us. Who are you? Do you uh, work for DMP? Yeah, yeah, I uh, mean uh, no. Uh, fuck it. Yeah, I'm with DMP. You 5 -O? What the hell is going on? There are some creatures on your tape. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, but but we didn't make that shit. I mean, one of the guys stole it, found it in the creepy house in the hills. We just copied it and put our names on it. Worse than anything we ever did. Worst thing I ever saw. Whatever. You guys aren't exactly angels. Some of it, yeah, it, it was it was bad. But you know, no one ever really mattered. J junkies, runaways, most mostly doing them a favor. This must be the call poetic justice. Please, please, just, just get me out of here. Oh no! Ah! What? <laughs> Stood on you. Tape, complete hollow tape. Am I safe to put this away now? You think? Yeah. You 
can uh, get up now, you know, if you want to. No? Okay, let me just lay down. Let me lie down. Be a great calendar. I can't see anything on it, but I can see beer. Oh, that's alright, it's enough for me. Come on, mate. Can I open this door now? Yes. Well, that was interesting. The house in the mansion is the knife I forgot. I didn't. I didn't ask him where it was. What? I wish you wouldn't do that. Keep taking my gun off, mate. Yeah, I couldn't get some. Well, I can't shoot through that. Six or seven. Well, to tell you the truth, you know, the I kind of lost track myself. So. <laughs> I should shoot, but I ain't just getting lucky. Well. <laughs> Do you, punk? Smash the door. Is anybody in here? No, everybody's gone. Oh dear. Better get out of here. What's in there? What about 